TCAF is still my favorite comics related show just because the amount of energy here. When I come to TCAF, I see new creators all the time uh, who are making incredible comics, original comics about uh, a multitude of subjects. It's like cool indie, you know? It's what's left over from the, the zine uh, tradition back in the day. What are your thoughts on TCAF? Why is it important to be here? It's, it, this is an actual, like, authentic comic book. So many comic conventions have gotten to be like, here's people that were on a zombie show once, right. and this is actual comic artists and creators that are just really making great stuff. This is free, it's at the library, and it draws in a lot of people to the comics world. That's always good, because so you, you always want to bring new people into the fold, and I think this is a really good show for that. This is North America's most, let's say, most acclaimed gathering of cartooning art. This is all about the people who make comics and comics as a medium. The Toronto comic art scene is certainly rich and diverse, and there's a lot of crossover with the Toronto independent video game scene, which is why there's lots of video games here at TCAF, and there have been for the past couple of years. And it's growing even more because now there's content over at the Masonic Temple. Let's head over there. We wanted to put you know, a lot of interesting guests. It's our first year. We wanted to have some of our bigger names in the mainstream comics world be a part of this venue. And we've also got live drawing and music going on. Really something festive for the Toronto Comic Arts Festival this year. Any chance for the festival to expand? All for it. So, yeah. yeah. Let's take over all of downtown Toronto and yeah. right? just cover really it with comics and stuff. That'd be great. Yeah. Which one? I love the diversity. I love the opportunity that people have to come here and find something. Some people are, are under the impression that uh, comics are just superheroes. This convention usually breaks that misconception right down to the ground and, and people could come and find a lot of things that I, I'm sure that they'll enjoy. During the first few tea caps, uh, I would just have people come to my table like, what's this? I'm like, it's my comic. They're like, what's a comic? And I get to explain words and pictures working together, making love on the page and like, uh, it's such a great show for kind of creating new readers. I love TCAF. I do a lot of literary festivals and comic shows. This sort of combines the, the best of both of those. It's a really laid back vibe. It's really uh, focused on the books and the art and the creators and the fans.